Hi, it's Tommy. So I just wanted to quickly show you my next project I'm going to be working on. It will probably be a quite a big project, so it will take some time to put everything together. But uh, I found this site, Cryacle, that uh, they make a bunch of different 3D printable planes. That you can buy the STLs for and uh, print them out and just build your plane yourself. And then you can connect them with your flight controller and uh, every other electronic you need. So they have the bunch of different models. They even have a free one for a three channel uh, little plane here. That you can just create an account and uh, download from their page. But the one I chose to print or a buy and print is this one called uh, Discover 1200 so it's quite a big big uh, airplane or drone and uh, the quality of the model just uh, looks just great so uh, I really want to see how it turns out and when I have all the parts printed but uh, like you see here in the sketch there's quite a lot of different parts that I need to be printed out and I only have a one small little printer to work on at the moment so this will take a lot of hours of printing all the small details and uh, everything seems to be thought out and you can even order different canopies or the form parts where you can put different action cameras or different FPV systems in them uh, so I have some I have an old plane I crashed a while ago so I have the servos and motor and everything from that I was going to test with this and see if it works I think the engine might be a bit bit small and I'm not 100% sure about the servos but uh, hopefully I can get it flying somewhat at least with the parts I have already lying around that's what I was planning at least I'm really impressed with the quality of the model itself. So when you go in and look and you can see all the small details. Uh, this is the, just the front fuselage part. The first part of the fuselage looks like this. Or if we take a look at another one. Let's see maybe part of the wing and see how this turns out in the, in the model. So this far I'm really impressed with the quality when you uh, when you get the STL files. Even if it's 3D printed, as uh, the specs say, it should weigh about 700 grams when it's all printed and put together. And when you put in the battery and some more parts, it's uh, somewhere a bit over a kilo maybe. So it won't be a light plane. Hopefully it will be stable in the air. I also talked about maybe getting some foam board uh, i'm building a plane from a foam board instead uh, i might even do both both the things just to have just another project to start building on but i guess uh, when i'm from this channel i hopefully can force myself to actually do my projects and not just buy the stuff and never finish uh, and we will get the flying plane soon but it will uh, at least take a couple of weeks of printing a lot of parts and big parts so and uh, when i get it flying the next step is to get the ardu pilot flight controller so i can get some automatic flights running on it i really want to start with some mapping projects but i'm not sure if the airplane is the right way to do it or i should just buy a phantom 4 pro uh, as it has everything already built in it with the GPS and camera and everything. But um, this will still uh, be a farm project to try and see if I can get it working as I want to. So thanks a lot for watching my video and uh, stay tuned to see more of my project and uh, fly safe.